and there's a constant you know the thing about Tommy sniffing in his videos or sort of, sort of that constant sort of very sort of tiny cough he sort of has now I'm not making that accusation because I don't know right I'm not I'm not privy to it I've no I've only I've met him very briefly once he's talked about we talked about uh, football at Luton and stuff like that because I used to live near Luton but I will say one thing I checked what I, I've given now okay you know uh, I have not given him much money I, I gave him a tenner once which was just before he went to, to um, court last time um, I don't have to explain myself but I will um, I'm, I'm, I'm I'm vastly overqualified for the job I do so I don't earn particularly a lot of money so I work have to work hard for my money that's 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 my my concern but um but uh i this the principle isn't it i've given a tenor i don't really like the idea that's gone up say you know what's his name danny tomo's nose or whatever and i'm not accusing him or avi yemeni i don't know i'm not saying it they've not answered it that's the point i'm making now but why 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 have i uh why would i not say i'm a support of his movement i suppose is more exact um well, I think a real turning point was, as I said, I made a video about it. I think it's one of my most viewed videos, actually, surprisingly to me. But the um, the um, the thing about Mark Collett, um, I thought was really, I thought it was, I thought it was appalling then, and I still think it was appalling. You know, for a start to go after Mark Collett, Mark Collett had been had given qualified support to Tommy Robinson. He not he not gone for Tommy Robinson. He not reveled in Tommy Robinson being put inside, so why go after him? It was it was basically he was sort of a, a focal point for them, in a sense, dealing with Shazia Hobbs and Dion. Dion had supported him. Shazia Hobbs had supported them. They come to his events. They spoke at his events. He was, they, 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 I don't, know, I don't know what their relationships were, but they, they, they'd been in an exchange, hadn't they? Sort of, is it mutuality? You'd call it, you know, some sort of mutual regard for each other. But then he was inside, and then they said things about, um, effectively, ask questions about um, Jews or Jewish culture or, or some sort of Jewish behaviour, and they were suddenly, you know, unpersoned by them, by Tommy Robinson's sort of um, acolytes, you know, his sort of his, his his main supporters. So I didn't think it was very nicely done. But I thought the video was the the you know the the um, was was something of a final straw i did not like the way they did it it was very amateurish i said at the time i won't go retread it all over but i thought it was appalling now it seems to me that the people around him um now um i don't i don't particularly care um you had avi yemeni i mean um who i did i did i did will myself to ignore sort of the doubt, doubts i had about him but they seem to have been sort of confirmed I mean, he's very arrogant, isn't he? You know, it um, sort of sweeps into these sort of situations and has his sort of preset questions, you know, about, you know, and basically trying to trying to sort of gotcha people that Israel's some sort of, uh, you know, glorious democracy in this sort of sea of sort of appalling sort of Arab Muslim barbarity. Now, um, I, I don't think that's I don't think that's really true. I don't think. I don't think it's an excuse. I would say this to anyone, not just him, but it's not an excuse that um, for Israel's behaviour in many ways um, that it's uh, a democracy. What does that mean? Um, Hitler was voted in. For the Nazi Germany was effectively at the very beginning, anyway, a democracy. So that's not some sort of uh, you know get out of jail card. Um, or there's half. Or there's, I think is it half a million or a million. Arab, Arab, Arab Israelis. Well, they've got no choice, have they? Really, they're sort of there, aren't they? This they've been surrounded by an Israeli state. I can't imagine that they're particularly happy. But I mean, yeah, okay. So you're giving the vote to half a million Arab Israelis. What about the millions of Palestinians that have been displaced? So my point is, is his arguments can be easily dismantled. Really, you know. Um, and but the thing that one of the things I disliked about him, I told you at the time, very briefly again, was he was he enjoyed seeing that Palestinian getting shot dead. And I think there's something it's beyond it's beyond your your your, your um uh the that primordial kind of thing about you know seeing your enemy killed. You, you would even if you did it, you don't publish it, do you? You know even if you're glad, you, I, I just thought it was disgusting. 
and the and the tweet the dismissive tweet i saw about the girl that got raped by the the 11 israeli lads so it's also you know i just i just don't like him so i'm not i just don't like his team really and um uh i thought it was really bad form the way they went after someone who'd not really gone for them uh also i should make special mention of what happened what about lucy brown and what the way she was sort of treated i mean the narrative that they would happily you know the you know the, the shazir hobbs uh dion and lucy th- so three women incidentally you know is that a factor i don't know but that that you know they ask any questions and you're out the door we're a free speech movement you know but don't ask any questions or don't you know don't mention the jews and that's it it's, you, 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 you know you have to have some philosophy about your movement you know um or you're just really just a, a, a sort of money-making machine aren't you and that's what Lucy Brown seems to have sort of touched upon now. A couple of things. Maybe the narrative's right. Maybe she is some a treacherous middle class bitch. I don't know. I don't know, right? But what I would say is a couple of things that sort of, in a sense, well, not I don't want to mitigate things, but you know, uh, but 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 well, she is quite young, okay. And it seems that a lot of a lot of Tommy's fans will be older than her at least. And uh, it seems that she received such dogs abuse that she's obliterated her. Um, she's annihilated her own social media profile. That's not particularly good, is it? Um. And she did help out Tommy at times. She did work for him. She 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 supported him quite uh, stoutly at times, as far, as far as I can tell, anyway. And yeah, you know, okay, a bitter ex employee. How do you deal with a bitter ex employee? Okay, maybe 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 Tommy had justification. Just put the shutters up. But in another sense, um, she made a very serious accusation about um, Tommy's movement and included Tommy in that accusation. When I think she spoke to Morgoth, I think it was in particular. Now, this has never been answered. These movements never answered this. That's another sort of media tactic. But, you know, you just just ignore it because it's not had enough purchase, say. And she's and all the supporters have piled on her, so she's run off into the distance. I can't say, would you be particularly impressed by um, lots of kind of uh, men? It would be men, wouldn't it, piling onto a, a young woman that had helped at points, was, was even a heroine of yours at certain points, you know, the, the, the John Sweeney documentary thing. Um, you know, and has to basically withdraw. I don't think that's particularly edifying. I don't think would you be proud of that? And but the, the central argu- the central accusation has never been answered. As I say, you know, uh, the the she accused them saying that well, they ask for money all the time to support their ventures, their documentaries, whatever their exposés. Yet they're all taking um coke, um you know snorting cocaine. And there's a constant you know the thing about Tommy sniffing in his videos also, sort of that constant very. So tiny coffee sort of has now. I'm not making that accusation because I don't know, right? I'm not. I'm not privy to it. I've no. I've only. I've met him very briefly once. He's talked about. We talked about uh, football at Luton and stuff like that because I used to live near Luton. But I will say one thing. I checked what I, I've given. Now, okay, you know, uh, I have not given him much money. I, I gave him a tenner once, which was just before he went to, to um, court last time. Um, I don't have to explain myself, but I will. Um, I'm 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 vastly overqualified for the job I do, so I don't earn particularly a lot of money. So I work have to work hard for my money. That's 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 my my concern. But um, but uh, I this is the principle, isn't it? I've given a tenner. I don't really like the idea that's gone up. Say, you know, what's his name, Danny Tomo's nose or whatever. And I'm not accusing him. Or have you, Emily? I don't know. I'm not saying it. They've not answered it. That's the point I'm making. Uh, Danny Tom is another one. I've actually even made videos about him. But I just, um, you know, again, I possibly shouldn't have done. I was, I was, I felt I was part of something and trying to help in my own sort of small way. And um, I have ignored my reservations about people when I shouldn't have done. So I, I can't say I'm particularly impressed by the people he's surrounded by. Um, and I think he's, yeah, I don't particularly care for the Zionism thing. He and and someone and someone said in my comments it was obviously it was it was a Muslim he had a Muslim name anyway probably may not be a Muslim saying to me, oh what about Tommy's answers about these is Israelis raping that British girl yet well we're not going to get that sort of answer is it, but I can't say I dislike him I'm really you know really I really don't I don't dislike Tommy or anything like that I still I said it I think he's brave and stuff, but I think I think there's a wider point to be made that. Um, that that it just becomes a cat and mouse game. It becomes a cult of personality, because it, if you think about it, I suppose we'll give context to why I, I feel I've moved on 